You are now listening to 15 Minutes of Fame Radio. Let's go! They want to ask you, uh, have you ever been before battle told, yo man, don't talk about my mother or don't talk about my dog that just died or have you ever been... I you think know, it's understood. Like, you know, I think certain things is just understood. Like, why would you sp- don't speak on none of my dead homies, like, mm-hmm. unless it's gonna be in a good way. Like, I love good times, and if I do go to heaven and meet Doom, he's gonna Tori shake my hand because that's my nigga. Like right. I love that. Like, I was, well, I was hoping for that. It's, it's making my my brother Dame live on. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. If you if you coming at my if you coming at my dead brothers in any kind of negative negative way, this is something I stand on. Like I right. gotta just I don't, I don't care about the money that I'm making tonight. I don't care about nothing, bro. If you about to just walk in here talking about my mama getting shot and not being able to walk, bro, you might get shot and not be able to walk. Like, that was crazy. You ain't about to you have, you don't even know nothing about that. You ain't never. Flatlined on the table and died and been shocked to come back to life. Don't speak on it, right? Because it ain't your business. You don't know nothing about it. Don't that ain't nothing to laugh or joke about. It. You know what I'm saying? And that's so, never been your style to do that to anybody style. else. Never, not no dead people. Right? Get down like right, that. right. I talk about your dead beat daddy. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna talk about your dead brother. Right. It's not my style. I don't feel like it. I like that, man. Some things don't need to be said. Like it should just be. You know, common practice like understood. Me has always been kids and and dead people. So it's like they can't defend themselves. You know what I mean? So I always thought that was wrong to mention somebody that can't defend themselves. Have you have you ever been asked by somebody like yo, you know, don't mention this, don't mention they know that? I ain't cut like that. So most of the time, I don't really have those conversations. With okay. Nobody cut. They know I ain't cut like that. And you never told somebody yo, don't. No. I mean, the way it should be. I mean, I don't, yeah, cause I don't really got nobody around me that, like, I don't know. I never, yeah, I never had to tell nobody don't speak on certain shit, because it should just be understood, bro. I, I agree. If you don't know nothing about that life, bro, don't be speaking, because that's my only thing. Like, just my dead brothers, that's, that's all limits. And my mama situation, you could call my mama a bitch. You could say, his mama sucked my dick. He could say, his mama... You can say anything that's not personal about my mama. Mm-hmm. Something that could have went for anybody, mama. I don't give a fuck. Right, right. If you get into detail about my mama being shot in the neck and none of that, fuck, I got fucking back up. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's how I really be thinking. Guess who's going like to doing jail that. tonight? Yeah, I'm going. I'm, you gonna have to kill me. You have to kill me because my mama will not be watching the battle of me sitting there watching the nigga talk about Woo. September 12, 1992. Cause that's the day that I almost lost my mom, and I, I, and May, I never knew that. May 17th, 1992, her sister was killed, which is his mother. This is this is my this is my brother right here. First cousin, but it's my it's my brother because right, my right. mama and his mama got shot the same year. Wow. Our grandparents adopted both of us. Wow. So my granddad had to take me and my brother in, and my mama ended up making it. She ended up Thank popping God. out the coma, wow. waking back up, and came and got her son back. I never knew that about you, man, and know you for a long time. Yeah, so, so you know, 1992 was a rough year for my grandparents. You know, Imagine, man, for man. my dad. My and mama, for you? My mama got shot, she almost died, and my daddy left. He rushed her to the hospital. So, don't speak on that type of shit, bro, because that's a real situation. Like, you know what I'm saying? Think about some battle rap shit about me. You know what I'm saying? Right, Talk right. Talk about the six bitches in the pool. Talk about, <laughs> <laughs> Talk about that shit, because this shit too real to even be playing. You know what I'm saying? And niggas is doing too much yeah. trying to win a battle, and they got to cut the ball. Shit. Niggas is coming with niggas coming with too many gimmicks, bro. I ain't gonna lie. What they do for view. Uh, I'd say 